Hello everybody, this is Fronty Toe Bobbin here, and welcome back to Train Rider VTS 2! So we've made quite a lot of progress in the series, and there's some stuff in my past screen as usual. And it is time for yet another scenario. So this is how far we have come in this series now. And today is not just any scenario. But this will be the second to last scenario here in Train Drive ATS 2. The 4012 Commuter Rapid in Nagichu. I believe the second to last one. Let's just, yeah, it's, I like to be sure to make sure to check all the red buttons or hit all the buttons. Anyway, so yeah, here's where we're going so far. And yeah, so in the last episode, we actually did two scenarios, but they were pretty short scenarios. I figured, well, why not do two in the same episode? Uh, this scenario, though, is a longer one. So we're only doing one scenario today. So the 402 Rapid Express, take a look here. Uh, so Shinharyo and go to Nagichuo. I believe this is a local stopping service. I mean, it's called Commuter Rapid Express. So I believe we're going to be going from one end of the route to the other, but we're going to have a lot of stops in between. So... Commuter isn't exactly my favorite kind of service to drive because it just isn't. <laughs> but um, that's what we're going to be doing today. So uh, yeah, I guess we'll stop uh, messing around and let's get to it. Before we get started, be sure to check out my Fiverr gig. Link is in the description. Alrighty, so we're starting here at Neki Chu, which I believe we are in the southern end of the route. So yeah, we're going to be going from south to north, so A, since we're going to be going by that other line, we might have another green train appearance in this episode. I uh, always love seeing the green train. Um, yes. Alright, so we're ready to go. Yeah, there we go. Alright. So this is a commuter service, um, so lots of stations to stop at. In fact, some of them don't even have a time trial. Yeah, so some of these stations don't have to get there at any specific time. We just have to just get there. Um, but of course, we do. It is so important that we do at least keep up with our speed. So this way we're not late to all the stations because some stations will have a time trial. So it's important that we get there in time. All right, come on. Our... Okay, let's just check. Ah, speed. All right, and there's a train. Hello there. Oh, dang, I forgot I was supposed to, supposed to get a picture. Oh, I'm sure we'll see that train again at some point. Actually, I can't remember what train was in Thunder the last video. I think it was that one, so yeah. Alrighty, and look at that. We've just departed the first station. We're already approaching our first stop of the day. It's the green train! Yes! My favorite green train, but of course, it's right as we have to stop at a station. Hello, green train. How are you today? Yes, always love seeing the green train. Yes. Alright, but let's focus on what we're doing as we need to stop at the station. And Okay, it looks like I was able to get the bricks just in time here. But of course, it's not, you know, it's not messed it up. Let's make our first of the day a good one and not a totally disaster. Oh, I believe we're in, a, in the middle of rush hour, actually. There's going to be a lot of action. Oops. Uh... Okay. All right, I had to get on the emergency brakes there. I eh, only threw away five points, though. Now maybe we're going to get it back. Fifth, 61. Okay, pretty good for our first stop of the day. All right. So here we are at the station. You know, this would actually be a pretty interesting station to rail fan at, I just realized, because you can see you have the mainline trains, but you also have the trains on the uh, on the the, uh, the green, the, the, the other line. Actually, I believe as, as we play more of these scenarios, we have more of the fixed position viewing, but why would you do any of those? Well, you can do flight mode, that's right. So, yeah, so, uh, as I mentioned in the intro, this, this scenario that we're playing is the second to last of all the scenarios, which means after this scenario, we only have one more scenario to go, and then we will have completed all the scenarios here in front of ATS-2, and then we're going to unlock flight mode, which is something that I know that a lot of you guys really want to see. You know, guys have been practically begging me from time to time, saying, Hey, Ferni, can you do a flyby? How do you get a flyby? Blah, 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 blah. It's coming very soon. Don't worry. We only have two scenarios left to play in this series, and then it will be flight mode time. But we still have to do this scenario, and then one more scenario, and then that'll be it. Um, so, since we have uh, this scenario to play, yeah, so this is just a, so this is a full run 
scenario, but lots of safety stop bats, so it's going to be a bit more slower. Yeah, you know I like to get up to the speed limit and go fast stuff like that? Yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to do that today. I believe this is an all-stops local... Wow, you sure wait a long time for me to tell me on the brakes, Mr. Game. Uh... Ah, we'll be fine. Okay, we did have to use the emergency brake that first time. Let's not do that again. You know. <laughs> I still have no idea where the breaking point is in this game. <laughs> I'll be, yeah, we're 12 episodes into the series and I still have no idea where to actually break. Oh, well. Okay, this is a much better stop. Let's see. Okay, that was pretty good. A bit rough, but pretty good. 74 points, yes. We said fast forward mode so we can make this nigga bike just a little bit quicker. Because we're now getting a phone call. <laughs> a phone call in the game, not a phone call IRL, <laughs> by the way. So, train drive ATS2. Well, yeah, the end of the series is near. Um, I think once once the series comes to its conclusion, then these uh, these bills these bills of train drive ATS2 are going to be a bit more sparse and may not even happen altogether. Actually, I'm not, I'm not sh okay. To be completely honest with you, I'm not 100 sure what I'm going to do with this game once the series is done. I do have a couple ideas, but we'll see. I definitely wonder what the last now is going to be like, though. Because, um, I've never actually, uh, done, gone this far into Train of ATS 2, like, uh, I did make an attempt to do all those scenarios back in the day, but then around, like, the 10th one, I just gave up and was like, nah, I'm tired of this, I just want to just get, I want flight modisms. Yeah, we really don't get the speed. Um, on this in the scenario, yeah, you know how we in the express scenarios where we get we get to some pretty fast speed. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna happen today. As I believe this, I mean, it says commuter rapid. I don't actually know what that means, but I assume this is just gonna be an all stops local. Okay, it is telling me it was telling me to get on the brakes quite uh, quite late there, but I think that's just because if we don't have to get on the brakes that quickly because you know we're not going that fast so yeah I think I'll, I'll go the brakes a little bit too soon there so next time I'm all gonna break for the brakes once the uh, you know once that comes up okay it's a teeny bit past but still within the one meter thing so not bad that was 67 points okay not bad you know with how many stops we're gonna have today I wonder if we can get 1,000 points hmm Alright, here we go again. Alright. So, this game... or Yeah, we were only... Here's the thing. We were only doing half the speed limit there once we came up to that station. I reckon... That... We can just get on the brakes when the thing... I mean, basically, my breaking point has just been whenever that yellow thing comes on. Like, hey, please stop here. That's Every time that comes on, that's my, that's my reference to where to break. Also, hey, there you can see the uh, train of ATS-1 train. Oh, barely see it through the trees. There it is. I still remember what train, what class the train is, but there you go. Oh, there's a train in the... Uh, hello. <laughs> I was so focused on the train on that line, I didn't even realize there was a train coming on the other line. On our line. Alright, goodbye, Mr. Other Trains of the World. We'll explore you in more detail soon. I think the last time I've done flight mode on this route was oof, a really long time ago. Well, yeah. Basically, ever since 2017. You know. I have had Trinity. I mean, I've now had Trinity ATS 2 for about a year now, ever since I got my third iPad Air, the one I'm using now to record this video on. But, um. I haven't been able to actually get back into flight mode because. Well. Because. Because I want to play with all these scenarios, of course. Alright, we're not going to get on the brakes until... 
can get the message. There it is. Alright, there we go. The NR Central line. Yeah. You know what I want to know about? What is the Skyfi line? <laughs> yeah, I think it's actually busy, but then they just say that now, so it's fun. Okay. And, uh, oops. Oh, it stopped a little bit soon that time, actually. Hmm. Yeah, I could have gotten that a little bit better. 34 points. Really? Wow. Okay. That's all I get for stopping 0.5 meters. Too quick. Okay, fine. Just give me a laugh. The thing is with these breaks here in this game, though, it's so hard to stop in exactly the right place. It's no wonder that they made it so you only have to score like positive points in order to actually be able to, you know, stop in the right place. Are right, about to come side by side with the uh, thinking line again. Okay, I thought we were gonna. Yep, no, we're done. Not done with it just yet. Might see one more sighting of the green train. Oh, it's coming. There it is. Green train again. Yes, I love this green train. Yes. And this is where we part ways. Also, wow. Uh, <laughs> we are not picking. Look at I'm on full throttle. I'm losing speed. Man, this is a steep hill. Come on, power. There we go. Alright, go or die. Next stop. Okay. And on the brakes. There we go. Look at that. We Right when we approached the platform. Okay. That's how slow we were going. Bleah. Then we can coast for a bit. And get back on the brakes. Oh, I was... Okay, still... Okay, that's a little bit past the thing, but... Should still be alright. 55 points. Yes. And this was making noise outside, because of course they are. Oh, this actually was our first um, scheduled stop, I believe. No phone call. All right. I'm not sure if we're in rush hour. What the heck is it? There's someone outside. Oi! There's someone outside the snail roadhouse, IRL. Oi, what are you doing with your stupid... Hang on. Give me just a second. Alright, that's over. <laughs> Had a uh, interruption there. Some some guys, the ladder, I guess they were trying to pick off something from the roof of the uh, snail road house. Um, not sure why. But thankfully it lasted a couple minutes and they're gone now. So, um... I forgot what I was talking about before that. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, I'm, I'm sure I'll come up with something else. I'm sure, yeah, so I'll improvise. Look at these white walls. <laughs> have I? Yeah, no, we have been here before. Not very much, though. Yeah, okay, it's, it's been a little bit since the last Trinity BTS 2 episode. Um, uh, yep, Generation, Generation 4. We're uploading two videos a week now, and yet... There still seems to be some gaps in some of these series. 
Oh, so he's going down the oh, Okay. Huh, that's interesting. We actually went faster to where we had to. Oh, okay. Are we getting like on a slow train again? Oh, no. Don't tell me there's going to be another one of those episodes. Alright. Looks like this might be another episode of Get Stuck Behind a Slow Train. Oh, that is a pretty sharp corner. So maybe that's just a warning or something? Uh, the next signal is red. Okay. Okay. Uh, oh, God. went a little bit over again. I mean, not, not buying a great amount, but still. Eh, it's 61 points, though. Not bad. Not bad. And let's be waiting here for a couple minutes. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess for fast forward, yes. Yeah, thank goodness for fast forward because we didn't. Because I just remembered in the last turn of ATS episode, we were actually held up for about five minutes, and for some reason we didn't get any um, fast forward mode. I guess I think fat. You know, I think you only get the fast forward mode when you're stuck at stations. Hmm. Fair enough. Oh, hello. Guess that's the reason we're here for so long. Express train going through okay fair enough oh well that is how i would run the railway uh, faster train always goes first all right and we're off again I got downhill gradient. I remember this. Yeah, now I've been gripping this route so much, I'm really starting to, like, learn it. Like, I learn, well, I mean, I still don't really know, like, the order of the station names or anything, but I do know, like, I do know certain landmarks now. Oh, we can pick up speed. Okay. Speed! I think at this point, this is probably the route that I know the most. Out of all the three Trinity ATS games. Trinity ATS 1, I am getting to know that route a bit better. And to be honest, it was kind of surprising how little I've actually driven on, or how little I've actually seen as of, as of, um, yet. And Trinity ATS 3, I'd say, is what I know the least because, uh, I still have, I, I still have to do a you know, that actually goes the whole route. You know... I oh station stop. Whoops, guys, stop here. Um, um. Okay, we made it. Oh, it's we're gonna run the platform here. That would have been a bit scary. Nope. Stop too early. Come on. Oh, come on. Oh, that's time I stopped too early. Ah! Train just ground. To Look at that. 21, really? Wow, okay. I tried to save it and pull up a little bit further, but no. I, I, I apparently I went so slowly that I, yeah. Yeah, once it comes to a stop, then. Yeah. Nah. I kind of want to score 1,000 points in this because there's so many stops, but it's like enough, but we only scored 21 points. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Really, what matters is that we just, you know, get the points. The next stop is 
Yeah, main thing we need to do here. Well, yeah, I think I guess this will just go more than one point. I don't know. Again, if somebody wants to do that scientific test for me, uh, please do. I, I would do it, but I kind of need to do these YouTube videos, so. If there's somebody out there who hasn't done all the scenarios yet in either Trinity Test 1 or 2, try to get, like, the minimum score you can that's above zero. Like, if you can score only one point, then, yeah. I think the hard part is really just scoring 100 points. As I am... No, we're going to stop here. Let's see, another... The uh, older trains, I think. Okay, it's going to better stop this time. Yeah, I'm stopping. Shut up, shut up. Mm. Oh, that's on a little bit. Ah, it's so hard, man. Look at that. 0.4 that time. How many scores are points? 36. Yeah, okay. You know what? Nah. Nah, nah. I don't think we're going to score. 404. Oh, that's hilarious. Yeah, 404 not found a lot of points today. Or, yeah. I say today, of course, we still have the whole rest of the scenario to get some more points, but still. So where are we in the map, then? Oh, we're actually... Eh, not in the center of the route, but we're getting close. Actually, yeah, we're about midway through this scenario now. Speed level 110. We might be able to reach that as we're going slightly downhill. I think we're gonna go uphill. Oh no, is that flat? Oh, we're transitioning. And now we're level. Okay. This is an interesting route, though. You know something? I I want to see this route recreated in a different train simulator. I think the best one for that would be uh, SimRail once the editing tools come out. Yeah, did, did you guys know I play some, uh, been playing some Simra on the channel recently? This is my first live stream in the uh, multiplayer mode. And uh, in case you didn't know, Simra is going to be getting is editing. <laughs> in case you didn't know, Simra is going to be getting editing tools in the future. Well, in the near future, not like Train Sim World where they're going to say they're going to do it and they never do it. No, Simra is actually getting editing tools. Maybe some point this year? I don't know, but some point. But when those editing tools do come out, I would like to see someone remake this route for SimRail. And who knows, maybe that someone will be me. Yep, 0.2, not... Negative 0.2, not bad. Yeah, this one's, uh... 60 points, finally, a decent score. But yeah, who knows, that someone to remake this route might be me. I think it would be good for multiplayer mode as well. Like, I, I think a... You know, with all the other things you can do in multi... In, well, in SimRail and multiplayer, like dispatching and all the driving and stuff like that. I think this would be a really good route for that. And actually, this one isn't even that long, I don't think. So it wouldn't take that long to make either. Like, I mean, someone might even be able to make this route in maybe under a year. Like, it's about 26 miles or something like that, which isn't very long. So, yeah. This route probably wouldn't take that long to make. 
Chief trains here for the Skyfine Line. Hey, Skyfine Line. Yeah, I believe it's like 26 miles long. I'm not too sure, actually. But, yeah, it's not a particularly long route. Um, yeah. <laughs> the only reason why it might feel like it takes a long time to drive across this whole route is because, you know, you don't really go that fast. Coupled with the amount of stations you stop at, you know? Ooh. Yes! Oh! <sighs> Dang, I had the chance, but I got the brakes. Actually, that's not cool. That was good. That was good. 85 points! Yes! Finally! Alright. 589 points. Yes! I am the greatest trade driver of the world. Since we're about halfway through this route. But yeah, by the way, I mean, this scenario that we're driving is going to take about an hour, but that's because we have to stop all the stations, so, you know. It may feel like a short route, but with all those station stops, it adds up, you know. But... You know. Well, you know what though? A route like this would be able to like hold us over until we eventually get bigger content later down the line. And you know something else? If you were to make a one-to-one -one recreation of this route in Simrail or really any train simulator, the scenery would be wouldn't take that long to do because it doesn't really go out that far and the scene that is pretty close isn't wouldn't be that difficult to do so yeah I think even if a singular person were to remake this route it would only really take them probably about a year depending on how busy their life is And again, maybe that person will be me. By the way, how many, you know, that being said, though, how many of the people out there, though, know of, like, Simrail and Train of ATS? Actually, here's a question that I can pose to you guys, or if anyone's interested in making routes for Simrail, I'm not, I'm not paying attention to what I'm doing. Balls. Come on, game. I want to have some conversation with the people watching the video. <laughs> Good thing we only threw about, threw away about, I don't know, a few points there. Uh... Anyway, yeah. Like I said, uh, who, who out there, those of Simrail and Drain of ATS and might be, might want to remake this route for Simrail. Because, you know, with the way that the multiplayer system works over in Simrail, I think this route would be very good for that. It's short, but there's a lot happening in those short amount of miles. Next up. Alright. <laughs> okay, we're gonna get. Come on, let's take a good score this time. Okay, that wasn't a great stop, I must admit. <laughs> Again, it's so hard to pinpoint. Only 10 points for that. Well, there you go. Hmm. Yeah. You know, I might still be able to get 1,000 points, but I'm going to have to do really good at these next stops. Like, really, really good. And I'm not sure if I'll be able to muster that, but eh, we'll try. Oh, balls. Something else I'm going to talk about. Hello, train. Oi! 
I hit the value button by accident. <laughs> okay, the sound is now seems to be really delayed at my thing. Alright, next up is right here. I'm stopping, don't worry. Okay. Oops. Alright, come on. Ah. Okay, that one. I mean, we. Okay, well, we finally stopped in a good position. Except we got the bricks a little bit there. 64 points, yeah. Yeah, we, didn't, we went pretty slow. Actually, we got 99 points for our stopping accuracy. Except I kind of threw it away because, you know, parking and packing. It's, it's, this is a hard game, okay? <laughs> uh. And, uh, yeah, you know what? There's something else I was just gonna, gonna talk about, but I completely forgot what it was. Oh, yeah! I remember. Okay, so, um... I know that this this route is like based on a real world route, but is is this route that we're driving on right now? Is this like a one to one? Is this a one to one recreation, or not one to one? But the track layout is copied over from a real world route, or the guy just who made this just took inspiration from a real world route, but then kind of just built his own thing from there. Or like what? Like what, how? Easier, how difficult would it be if I were to trace this route using Google Maps or something? Hmm. I'm gonna have to look that up after this video. Uh, stop! Yep, threw away a few points there. Oi! Wait, we have to stop at the. Uh. Wait. No, we can proceed. Okay. Alright, we can proceed through. Alright, here's the big station where the brakes line is. But yeah, how easy or how hard would it be to like, um, trace this, I don't know. I'll have to look it up after this video. Or maybe if you guys, you know, if you guys know something, then maybe you can tell me. Now, so this video, of course, I'm recording this video on Monday. Um... Monday, okay, hang on, March. I'll tell you what, once I get to the station here, come on. Yeah. Okay, okay, that was a bit heavy there, but yeah. Okay, so today is March 6th. And it's really going up on March 8th. 54 points for that, by the way. Pretty good. Yeah, okay, 54 points. Yay. 600. Oh, 664 points. Really? We were away from getting 666. Oh, that would have been funny. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, so March 6th is the day I'm recording this video. This is March 8th. Um, yeah, so March 8th is when you're actually seeing this video if it's brand new, or maybe March 9th, if you've seen this video the day after. Um, yeah. So with that in mind, um, yeah, I might have found the answers before this video goes up, but again, you know, if you guys have any input and maybe want to tell me, you know, more about what this was based on, I'd be curious to know. I'm just kind of the guy who, you know, playing these games. I'm sure there's some people out there who know, you know, more about like the information of like what this about is based in real life or some other stuff and Thank you for using the things. This is the commuter rapid train bound for and I'd be curious to know. Alrighty, so now we're now we're on the top half of the route.
Hmm. Eh, it's been going to 75 because of course it is. Oh, that's going to 45. Okay. Because, you know, one day I just had an idea of if. Hmm. I wonder if I could trace this route and kind of remake it over and train some classic for now. Also, I would just lay the track, you know, I wouldn't, probably wouldn't work on the scenery all that much. Or maybe I would, I don't know. We'll see how, how carried away I get. And red. Good. Although we already commuted train, we stopped at pretty much all the stations, so I mean, we shouldn't really have to. Actually, what train is that? We just. Oh, it's another commuter rapid express. Oh. So we're pretty much following a uh, different train doing the same service. Okay. Let's get a good stop this time. I don't think we're gonna get a thousand points, but at least want to try to get close. Ah, uh, again, just a little bit too soon. I got there a bit delayed too. How many points for that? Thirty-four. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think unless a miracle happens, I don't think we're going to be getting 1,000 points. I mean, I don't think we've lost any points for a stop today, though, at least. I think we've only lost a few points for just speeding and... Okay, I did... Okay, so I was just speeding, I did have to apply the emergency brakes once, and what? Seven kilometers to the next station, okay. Look at that, we finally got a bit of a break. Alright, so we're we can just drive the train. And the next stop is the one that kind of sounds funny if you read it a certain way. Well, here in this game, it's pronounced Ostate. But, hey, if you were, again, if you pronounce it a certain way, well, it sounds funny. <laughs> I poured that on the previous episode, but you know what? If this is the, if this is the first ever uh, Train of ETS 2 video that you're watching from me, uh, the team, the team that we're about to... Uh, uh, that, th th okay, the name of the station that is our next stop, if you read it in the English language, it sounds a bit, heh, funny. Anyway, that's our next stop, and six kilometers away, so we get a bit of a break now. Thank goodness. What's he talking about now? Hey. Anyway, 95, I believe that's just through the station. Well, he's reaching that speed anyway, so. That's kind of fast. I mean, fast through that curve there. All right, 810, let's do this. Let's try to reach 110, because this, this will be the fastest we've gone today. Okay, so this isn't necessarily an all-stops commuter service. Um, there are a few states that we are skipping. And even a few trains that we're overtaking. Come on, let's engage in this race. Speed and power. But yeah, I guess we're not stopping at every station today. We're just stopping at most of them. But we've now that we're at the top of the road, we are just going to be skipping a few stations. That's a pure local train. So we stop at all of the stations in the world. Ernie Columbus Pro or not bad? 
Close to the speed limit. Uh, we can maybe uh, come on. Wait, reduce speed for what? I want to reduce speed. I'm going fast. Ah, uh, fine. Oh, balls. Yeah, I should have listened to the thing. <sighs> sharp curve. So not even a train in front of us, just a sharp curve. Well, unfortunately my speeding did throw away a few points and yeah, I've been away. Okay, yeah, so we're not getting a thousand points. Oi! Also, do you want me to go? Oh, balls. Oh, well, we had 666 points at least. Yeah, we're not getting a thousand points today. Oh, well. Eh, the possibility was there. Okay, come on, let's pick up some speed. I mean, the, you know, the game even warned me, said, hey, you gotta slow down. I was like, oh, but I really want to reach 125. Mm, I mean, 100, 125, 110, you know? All right, finally. Right, up to the. It's one of the tracks there. Another forty-five. Come on, man. We're really throwing a lot of points in the second half. Or throwing a lot of points away. <sighs> oh well. Again, I'm not really here to score as many points as I can. Really, I'm just here to just score the minimum amount of points necessary to pro progress to the next scenario. Uh, that's. I haven't seen that before. Are they building more tracks then? The And the next thing is Red Ray. <sighs> we're so close to the end of the scenario, and now we're being so find even more slow trains. Oh joy. Yep, the series is almost over, and we're still being stuck behind slow trains. Uh I'm trying to BTS things. Well, I say almost done with the series. Well, <laughs> we still have lost scenarios left to do over in Train of ATS 3 and Train of ATS 1, so this stuck behind slow trains thing is probably going to continue a lot more in thing. And who knows how many trains we're going to stuck behind in the last, last Train of ATS 2, well, not last, but the next Train of ATS 2 episode, which will be the last of all the uh, thingy scenarios. And we were red. Yeah, we're being stuck behind more slow trains. Uh, why? I hate being stuck behind slow trains. They're so slow. I just realized the next station stop is right in front of us, by the way. What's that noise? Oh, some saucy being sausages. Yeah. Um. Anyway, what the heck? Okay, so the next stage stop is right in front of us. It's literally, yeah. Hello there. Oh, we can go. Oh. I was only half paying attention there. <laughs> yeah. So remember in the last uh, Train of ATS 2 episode where we um, got stuck at a red light? I even mentioned this briefly earlier in this episode. 
where we got stuck behind a slow train and then we were stuck there um, and there was no fast forward mode so yeah you only get fast forward mode if you are stopped at a station if I was able to do uh, skip that shut up Thank you. If, if you're wondering, I was able to like cut the time there. It's because I basically hit the, well, no, in in the post production, I basically edited that part out of the video. Our next station is literally right there. It's right in front of us, and of course we can't pull into there because it's right in front of us. Cool. Nah, he's pulling away. The next station is literally right here. It's right in front of us. And we can just pull into the platform and stop there. But we can't because... It's stupid. Thank you. Alright. Oshitatte. Oh, train! Yeah, I think this is rush hour. <laughs> Why? Where's the? Th oh, there they are. Uh. Uh oh. Oi! Stop! Nope. Okay, you know what? <laughs> Let's just throw away some more points while we're at it. Who cares? Well, we were at 666 points. I don't care anymore. <laughs> this has been a long day. I probably still have some more sauce for this one. So, yeah, we're not going to get a thousand points. I probably. We could have. But I didn't try hard enough, so, yeah. You know what? If you, if anyone out there has gone this far in the uh, scenarios, in Trinity of, Trinity of ATS two, see if you can get one thousand points in this particular scenario. Now, this is the second to last scenario, so you'd have a lot of other scenarios you have to get through before you can get to this one. But once you do get to this one, see if you can get one thousand points. You probably can, because with the amount of stops, but you could probably even get 2,000 points if you actually stopped at every single station, you know, perfectly, which I can't. But if you can, well, see. See if you can. <laughs> <sighs> Alright, Nagi Shek Show, which I believe is actually the second to last stop to the last station, so... That's cool. I'll be put out of misery soon enough. Yeah. I mean, I don't I don't hate doing these commuter trains, but they do get kind of tiring after a while. Ah. You just said that the Your mother Oh my god! Wait, no, that's the next station. It's right in front of us. So. Why? By the way, why is he stuck? He's, why is the guy in front of me in the station for such a long time? Bim blah 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 blah. You know, it feels like everything has happened in this episode of Train of ATS 2. I was hooked by slow trains, we meet the green train, we do all the trains and things and blah blah blah. What a way! To do the second to last scenario. We only have one more scenario to go after this one. And yep. I have no idea how that scenario is gonna go. 
and uh, yeah. I can't wait to find out though, but first let's get this scenario over with. There we go, police station. In Nagishakusho, I believe this is. No, I don't think the second to last one actually. In fact, yeah, there's still. Eh, there's not too many. Where are we going to? Negi Chuo? Yeah, okay. So we're gonna be in like that tunnel section for a little bit, so I don't know how many seats we're gonna stop at there. We'll see. Actually, we're coming up to. I think the scenario is at like 836 or something, so. Yeah, we're getting close to the end of the scenario. Okay, here we are. Oh. Well, I wasn't, I mean, I stopped pretty roughly there, I will admit. But, I did least up the very play. There we go, 60 points. We're back in the 600s. Good. This guy's not taking off. Let's stop watching. Going fast forward! Yay! <laughs> Bit of a throwback to the Trinity VTS real fighting videos. Yeah. Green. Come on, I want the goal. I think we're running a teeny bit blind schedule, but I think that's just by design. Right. Come on. Push pass is the train. Uh, of course. Oh, Benton Dory. Okay. Which is... Actually, that's the second to last. That is okay. That's gonna be the second to last stop. But I know that because that is actually the second to last station before Nagi Chuo. So, only two stops left. Yay! Let's see if we can. You know what? We're back up to 635 points. Let's see if we can get exactly 666 amount of points. By the way, this this one might this might be a, a more rhetorical question, but who knows what six 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 means? I think it's a super. Well, I know what it is, but is it a, this is kind of a superstition? Hmm. I don't know. I'm just saying random stuff for the fun of it. Well, hope you enjoyed. Uh, all the uh, sausage that happened in this episode. So we went from end to end of the route again, but this time we just stopped at a million stages, which is why it took so long. So Benton Dory, that's right here. And stop. I'm stopping, I'm stopping. Okay, there's the marker. Uh, oh balls, I got the brakes way too late. <sighs> you know what? Who cares? Oh well. <laughs> Five for ninety. Uh, you know what that means, right? We're gonna have to get like, uh, you know what? Doesn't matter. Who cares? Who cares? We have one more stuff to go after this one, and then we're done. You know why I'm making these mistakes? Because I've been playing this game for such a long time and I've also done so many stops to the point where my brain is just fatigued. You know. And yeah, I'm not, I'm just not the biggest fan of like commuter trains, you know, stop start and yeah. I'm sure Andrew would like the scenario, but me. Nah, not really. Oh, do we have another signal? Yep. Can't even pull the station yet. Oh, you! Get out of the way! Mr. Slow Coach. Nagi Chu, yay, the last stop! Please change trains here for the NR Central line 
Last stop, and then we're done. That's a lot of lines. They should make a route called the Bank Coaches Line. <laughs> All right, we're nearly done, yay! Nearly done with the scenario. Yes. All right, let's go slow. Hey, this station that we roof and dad the 50 subscriber special. Can't believe we're nearly at 2,000 now. Anyway. Okay, oops, let's, come on, come on, ah, I want to get 666, come on, <laughs> 666, yeah, it's going to be a running theme in this, come on, we're probably not going to get 666, but I'm going to try very hard to get 666, but anyway, alright, let's see where we stop at here, mm, yeah, wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, okay, maybe, come on, we got it, we stopped in the right place, Come on. 679! Oh, it was so close! <laughs> oh, well. Oh, I'm glad that's over. Hurrah! That's it. That's the, yeah, that scenario. I only scored 37 percent on that scenario, really? Okay, so no thing, but... Alright, let's get a quick preview of what this next scenario is. It's the... Ooh, 001 Express Special Special. Oh, it's a quick one, too. Okay. You know what? We might be able to do a little bit of flight modisms. Yeah, this is a bit of a quicker scenario. Okay. So this is the triple zero uh triple oh one special express scenario. It's not that long, so we may even be able to do a bit of flight mode action in the next episode, maybe. Not too sure. We'll see. Anyway, this episode though has gone on for quite a long time with this being a very long scenario. So I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in whatever i make next